Norcross police are working to solve a serious issue in their community. A language barrier and fear of deportation prevents some members of the Hispanic community from seeking their help when they're victims. Natisha Lance went to Norcross to see how they're working to bridge that gap. Bridging that divide has taken some time and patience, but the city of Norcross says they want to make sure all of their citizens understand local law enforcement is here to protect them. We want them to be safe. We don't want them to be targets. Sergeant Arnelis Rivera has been called Norcross PD's secret weapon. There's a lot that's lost in translation. We don't want that. The Chicago-bred Puerto Rican is connecting the department to the city's Hispanic community. In 2012, the department noticed a spike in armed robberies and home invasions targeting Hispanics. Most of the crimes went unreported. They believe that uh, you call the police, you're going to get deported. The department realized they had to do something to make the 40 percent of their population feel safe. What they've learned is criminal law. The Hispanic Citizen Police Academy was launched as a way to educate Hispanic residents on the law. We are not the federal government, so we're not going to arrest anybody for not having papers. Since that first year, there have been three classes of graduates from the academy, a Facebook page all in Spanish and more bilingual officers hired to the force. Norcross's new mayor, Craig Newton, has made continued outreach a priority for his administration, despite what he calls politicized tweets about immigration from the president. But our focus here in Norcross is the practical. How can we make Norcross better? It takes a village, and so let's work together. And the outreach doesn't stop there. This Saturday, they're holding another event so the mayor can sit down with even more members of the Hispanic community. And already, Sergeant Rivera says she has a very long list of people who would like to get into the next Hispanic Citizens Police Academy, which will be held in July.